gunshots ring out. But this is no ordinary day at the shooting range. I know the threat's very real and I know it's out there and I continue to train every day for that. The training United pilot Michael Keane is getting has been constant since the events of 9-11. And Keane now finds himself in Atlantic City with a group of other airline pilots who are going through the ropes on how to react if combat Get occurs back. in the, the cockpit. Knife. Drop the knife now! Pilots climb aboard this plane where they are tested on both their judgment and reaction skills. Get out of the cockpit now! And instructors believe the simulated scenarios may save lives in the future. On the other hand, the idea of any kind of weapon on a plane still scares many people. Recently, a pilot was suspended after his gun accidentally went off on a U.S. Airways flight. A small bullet hole can be seen below the cockpit window. But the pilots taking the course feel that being armed is necessary because the world has changed. I fly with people so many times that ask me, when are things going to get back to normal? And, and I have to tell them there's a new normal. This is the way that we will have to live our lives. This is a change to the way things are. The Transportation Security Administration says just over 10 percent of pilots are authorized to carry guns aboard flights. Orla Reese, the Associated Press.